fucking year. Oh my god, the time we were on, guys. The last we played, it was chaos. It was honestly, uh, what's the right word? Embarrassing, ashamed, shameful. Just falling from the grace of the gods. Who wants to play? We're gonna summon some random person. Why not? Listen, this. Welcome back. What an intro. I'm so fucking like out of. I'm, a, I'm asleep right now. I am literally asleep. Shaddy Yerp. Welcome back to a Demon Souls remake video with Any Don't Panic. We are on part two to the road to Estero. The spear build that we're going to do in Demon Souls remake. And boy, that last video, part one, was embarrassing. We have realized Demon Souls Remake isn't a game to be fucking around with. I am a Demon Souls veteran, and even me, playing the game live with commentary and playing it like this, oh my god, oh my god, I was out dying, bro, I was, uh, hey, hey, good sir, clap at the presence of your fucking queen, son. Listen, this is the easiest boss in the game, but we're just summoning people because why not? Why not? Why not summon people? These losers have no idea. I'm just going to beg him. Beg him, please. Please grace me with your peasantry, you peasants. Okay. Before we go in, listen, fellas, they're going to have to wait. They're going to have to wait. They're going to have to wait and watch the queen smile. Listen! We are in part two. We skipped a few things in part one because your boy was dying against stupid ass bosses. Stupid ass bosses because I was just like not prepared for how much easier it was going to be later when I was not streaming. When I was not streaming, I went back in. I was whooping ass. No deaths, no mistakes. It was just like, why couldn't I do that when I was streaming? It was embarrassing. We died in the World 1 1 by like bum ass archers and fire dudes. This guy, look at this guy. He's, he's gonna literally die in exactly 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Okay, so countdown 30, 29. 8 of uh, 28, 27, 26, 25. He's gonna hit me, I don't even care. 24, 23, 22. He's gonna fall now. He's gonna hurt me, and guess what? I'm not even gonna heal. Boom, 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 boom. We're gonna just gonna you know, get our energy back. Boom, 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 boom. And then guess what? One more hit. This is. This is bitch stuff, guys. We don't have time for nonsense. We don't got time for that BS. Healing, getting, like, hit by stairs, whatever. The people we summon, they're just here to get their human form back. We're not even worried about that. We're gonna go right back to the Nexus. We are on part two. This is the sterile spear build that we're gonna go get soon. But to use it, we need a certain amount of ability. Uh, specifically, here it is, guys. This is going to be probably a level 60 build for PvP. I need to keep it 60 because it's a certain spell in my vision for this build, like Second Chance. Second Chance is a uh, spell that's absolutely amazing. And what it does is it literally gives you a second chance uh, if the name didn't give it up. Basically, if you get hit and the last bit of your HP and you die, it it gives you back to half of your HP. And it's so useful. And to use that, you need 100 MP. You look on the middle top, it says 81 MP. You see that? So we need about 15. We need about 15 to do it. But before that, we're going to get at least 30 faith. At least 30 faith to get this weapon. A little bit from what we missed last time, okay? What we missed was I got your I got this amazing my favorite my favorite armor. This gold armor. Oh my god, can I forgot how beautiful this game looks. Look at the shine on the gold armor. 
It's it's called the gold, the dull gold. What is it called? Dull gold set. It's basically a Valkyrie set. I use this for most of my uh, bills because it's my favorite. When I use a girl, I use this one as my favorite, and then the one from World uh, Three. World Three has a fantastic one. There, there is also one that's literally. Here, we're just gonna go do it real quick. World One One has a really cool one, which is like some bonded shit, some BDSM from Meralda. Prisoner Meralda has some BDSM. Don't. D hey, hey, stop it! Don't. By the way, you see in her left hand, we have a blessed mace. By having a blessed mace, what we have is constant healing. Why do we have that? Just so we don't have to use, like, smoke some grass, literally for this tiniest bit of health. It is really annoying. So, this gate only opens up, it, just in case you don't know this. You see on the left hand side where my face is blocking the first stone? The first stone. Me, my face, is the this first world, and you see that bright yellow glow? That's because I killed the red dragon, I killed some of the other boss, I just killed a second boss. It's pure white tendency. There's these red creatures that appear, they always, they always uh, drop grass. Guaranteed, they have a, uh, they will drop the grass. We're just gonna pick these up. So this area, you can only achieve if you get white tendency and to get white tendency you cannot die in human form by dying in human form you will miss out on getting that white tendency and here you i think you get the last bit of the the armor set for blue eye yep and about five of these efforts will spawn we're just gonna kill them just because we want some we want some space we want some space in case we have to fight Meralda in the big area, but we won't. I will show you guys. This is honestly some of the stuff that I do here seems like it's a walkthrough, but it's honestly a playthrough. I just I just show you guys what I do, but if it helps you, it's a walkthrough. And if you're just watching just to watch, it is a playthrough. So, Demon Souls remake has really simple AI, and I'll show you what I mean. This is Miralda. She's pretty dope with her laughing. I, Miralda, shall show you no mercy. No mercy. I really like that, that, um... What do you call? I really like that accent. I shall show you no mercy. Okay, let me show you what Demon's Souls re uh, Remake's AI is like. So, human AI. You can literally just two hand. You can let them attack, and then you go one, two, three, four. Just let you get one, two, three. It's literally just like that. They come close. You spam and spam. They won't. They won't. They got nothing on you. And then that's it. They're dead. They're just dead. It's my favorite part of this game. Hold on, hold on. Listen to the laugh. <laughs> How dope is that laugh? I absolutely love it. I just realized that she, our character, just looked like down at the item. And now she's not doing it right now. Whoa. I swear, she was just looking down. Okay, 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 okay. There it was. So if you look down, she looks down. I thought she was just acknowledged the item. So this armor set right here. It's the bondage set. This is my bondage set right here. If you were to use this, this is honestly a pretty cool set. I use parts, some of the parts here for my other builds, especially like the arms. I really like the arms. Okay, let's try to get 
a good lighting here. Look at that. That's some BDSM shit. Fifty Shades of Demon Souls up in this bitch, dude. I dig it. We might just have to, like, use this for our build. I don't know yet, because honestly, the spear is such a, uh, it's such a beautiful weapon where I feel like it deserves a specific set. You know what I'm saying? It deserves a set that's, like, wonderful. What the heck is this? Alright, back to our set. And on the top right, it's exactly 49.5 right now with 11 endurance, which is pretty good. 11 endurance is not a lot. I am currently using the Ring of Great Strength to give me just enough equip burden, just enough equip burden to make it under 50% so we can do fast roll, which is a, a mandatory thing. Any builds you do, probably do a fast roll unless unless you're doing a sh like strictly all defense build i got the evacuate spell so at any point in the game anytime i want i can quickly return to the nexus so just did part one one we can do for the white tendency but we can't do part one three until we finish a certain other bosses I don't know if I could do 1-3 yet, but we're not trying to do 1-3. We're going to go get the Sterile Spear, and maybe together we can look at the spear. I have yet to use the spear with any of my builds. This is my first ever, but I, I since Demon Souls came out 10 years ago, 9 years ago, if I forget, I've always wanted to have a Sterile build. Estrella. I don't know how to say it, but we're going to go get it right now. Iron Demon Soul. It's not sent to storage. Use, 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 use. Uh, we're going to level up one time. It takes 12,000 to level up. We have 15,000. Fantastic. What's up, baby boy? Where is... Where's our lady? Baby boo! Where are you? There she is. God, they made her so freaking awesome. The art design for her. Thou seekest the power of the soul, no? Yes, I, I shall Time touch to the demon inside. inside you. I would love to touch the demon inside you, woman. Mm. Okay. That wasn't creepy at all. <laughs> We're trying to get 30 faith. 30 faith is our goal all right we're gonna go before we go and accidentally die and ruin it we're not gonna take any chances guys when I'm streaming I am half of the human being half the human being I am borderline not even a full human I am a ghoul the playthrough in the first part oh my god Embarrassing. Also, because I hadn't played Demon Souls in a while, I was a little rusty. Anytime I'm pressing R1 to dodge because I'm playing Genshin Impact so much, you know I'm rusty. We're gonna purposely die. For new players, we die to stay soul form. For old players, you know what the fuck we're doing. Alright. So before we go, double checking. Tendency all the way five uh, five f five one five two five three anyway the world five has perfectly white tendency with the yellow glow to get the spear We go to five one five one And just in case you didn't know where to go, we're just gonna take you there. I have to go get it anyway. This is the road to the PvP build. Once we get everything, we're gonna obviously do a PvP highlight reel. Where I just will invade and hopefully learn how to use the weapon well. Because I never, never in my life made a... What's over there? 
Wait, my ADHD is kicking in, fellas. I have to mention my ADHD every single one, just in case you guys question my attention span and be like, well, that boy was talking about this, and then that boy was talking about that, then he forgot, now he's talking about this. What the heck, I can't, what's going on here? Oh, okay, I have to go down here. Okay, anyway, so for the, you gotta go through here. We're not gonna waste any time, you roll. Roll. You see the fire that misses safe. You go down here, you go down the hole here. You move in, keep falling, go down the hole there, and down the hole here. Just ignore everybody. There's this little plank, right? We go fall down, they start rolling. Roll, roll, roll your bow, gently down, demon souls. And we definitely want to kill to get Fane Stones. Fane Stones is going to help us get more blessed weapons later. And blessed weapons will make it easier for us to heal in the background and in case we uh just want to use a second weapon look at this guy look at this guy he's doing the whole combo back the fuck off so there's gonna be a bunch of little takashi six nines here we're just gonna Spamity spam, spamity spam, and hit the plank and get plagued. Oh my god, Takashi, stop snitching. Oh, you rats. Holy shit. These rats, leave me alone, rats. Leave me alone. Jesus Christ. Alright, we're gonna have to get rid of this freaking plague. Alright, so here. If you're following me so far, five world five one, you do a bunch of rolly de rolls, fall down a bunch of holy de holes, you go through the little bridge. Uh, if you're doing this for the first time ever, then you haven't gotten this far. You don't have the world tendency, and there's a fog gate here. This is the first fog gate, and you kick this thing to open to go through the fog gate. So. We're just gonna quickly go here and make a laugh. Look at that, there's a whole ladder. And with some message indicating there's something here. This ladder is not there unless you have pure white tendency. Look at these, look at these. Stop, sit down. And they make it very hard, hard by, it's really like thin, narrow areas so you can't be just you know willy-nilly running and, and shit okay back off okay back off it'd be really cool by having like this armor sir like if some enemies sort of react in a different way i don't know i think there's a big guy here these big guys, they seem scary at first, but they're not that scary. You just kind of bait their attack. One, two. One, two. Just... You know, Demon Souls veteran shit. Veteran shit on the bitch. Okay, so, as I said that, I have no idea where to go. There's probably a tiny little area. There it is. This entire part, again, only accessible with white world tendency. Pure white. P.W. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. He's dead. That's it. You know what? We're just, just to play it safe. We'll use magic. Make him come to us. Beat up the first attack. One, two, three. Dead. Do you see this? Again, just to uh, give you guys a heads up, I'm using the Crescent Falchion. You get this in World 4-1. If you look at my stats, to use this weapon, like, the only thing we would need is magic to, like, scale it, but that's not our build, and even then, we don't even have a magic build, but this weapon is that strong with very little effort to get it strong. You just gotta play it 
the uh, world four for a little bit. You get the weapon like in the first five minutes. All right, before we get this last guy, one, two, three. Simple as that. Veteran shit. We're gonna get the weapon. We are here. We did it. Oh. All right. Let's look at this. I can. Can I read this? Oh my god, my face is blocking it. A short spear of hard oak. I can't read the first word with with blah 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 with engravings as a spear is one of the few remaining relics of Boletari. I don't know. Belong to the holy knight Rizaya. Rizaya. The divine nature of the spear blah, 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 increases its wielder's resistance to plague and poison. I didn't even know that this had you know what's really funny is that this weapon wait this is can we level up this weapon with colorless souls so to use it we gotta get some colorless souls oh shit if you see our crescent felchion gives us 238 attack where Stral only gives us 188 do you see and this is a magic build. This is a faith build. You see on the bottom right, bottom left there, where on the little star icon it says you need 24 uh, faith to use this weapon. 24 faith and 18 dex. Hard to get. Where crescent, you need like 9s and 10s. Like, it's crazy. You Look at, look at, oh my fucking god. I'm on the wrong weapon. Okay, so oh my lord. Right there. I was tripping for a second now. You only need 9 strength and 10 dex. That's all you need. And this, th that uh, Crescent Felchion scales with magic with the A. How insane is that? 238 attacks. So Crescent Felchion is stronger than any weapon we can have. Even the main weapon that we wanted to use that is disheartening I am heartbroken I am heartbroken but we could two hand and make this stronger so now we have to get colorless souls oh my god guys we might have to do a whole other video on this Dang! Getting colorless souls is so uh, annoying. All right, we're just gonna quickly teleport the fuck out of here. Talesman of the God. How many Talesman of the God do we have? Hold on. What was that about? Here, take all my stones. Okay, so Talesman of the God, bro, we only have one, so to get a colorless soul, we can trade one Talesman of the God with, uh, our girl, the crow, our, our girl, I don't know why I said our girl, our bird. Interesting. Best of luck to you. Interesting, guys, what are we supposed to do about that? Thanks, now, I will so one of the main weapon, uh, main spells that we're gonna get is second chance, and to get second chance, you have to kill the, uh, I think, four, three boss, the old monk. All right, four, two boss, the old monk. So I just want to use this weapon real quick. Let's go use this weapon real quick, guys. Let's... Okay. Blessed mace. Let's put on... Buckler shield. It's actually a pretty light weapon. I am so disappointed that the weapon 
is so much weaker than the Crescent Felshin. Like, what the freaking freak? Alright, let's quickly see some of the animations here. Okay. 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 Uh, is this happening in real life? Back off. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ready? Go ahead, go ahead, attack me. Okay. Okay, that's like a regular spear animation. Woo! Beautiful. But these magical weapons, they can literally make everything disappear. Well, the animation sounds so cool. Okay, so R1, simple stab, stabity stab. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You see, my endurance is so tiny. One, two, three. So we can do only three attacks. R2. We can do only two of those. So if we do R1 and R2. Hmm. One-handed R. Okay. So they're usually all straightforward attacks. This stab, stabs, three stabs. So they're all just thrust attacks. Oh, look at that. So you do one and then... A second one right after. If you run, I'm sure it's just a quick swing. Okay. If you back up. Oh, that's different. So when you back up an attack, she doesn't go forward. Interesting. Okay. Running attack is just the other one. I wish the spear, spear would heal us like a blessing, blessed weapon. Alright, let's see it double handed. Woo! <laughs> Damn! Yo, that was actually effing beautiful. Here's annoying back up back up that is unbelievably unbelievably fun to use okay let's look at the spear guys this is my first time like appreciating this weapon even though it's not as strong as the other weapon this is literally the character i made just to use this weapon you understand in, in souls games when you cannot respect your character like in other souls games dark souls one two three you can respect respect means you could get far in the game and then completely do redo all your skill points all of the levels up we did you see on the right hand side for level 46. So level 46, so 45 points was used on vitality, strength, dexterity, magic, faith, etc. So we would re-allocate those points on different stats to use other weapons. In Demon's Souls, you cannot do that. You cannot respec characters in Demon's Souls, which is terrible. I really wish Blue Point had put that into the game the way you put items you could go to your items right now i have 35 just send this to storage right that is one of the best freaking additions and updates and changes that they put on this game that was not in the first game so you're telling me you couldn't do a respec with the archstone like the not the archstone the very first statue like where you you can Redo your character, give her a vagina or a dicks like cyberpunk, you could change your name, you could change, you could, uh, ask for forgiveness. 
Huh? I can ask for forgiveness, but not your points back? Come on. From soft and blue point. What were y'all thinking? Alright, I want to do a couple more. Let's see. Let's see the range. He's going to do a... He or she does lay it like a lounge attack, but he's not doing it. Come on. Bro, are you tired? He seems like exhausted. He's like, yo, I'm tired of this game. I'm just tired. <laughs> they make, they put me here. They spawn me. I got all this come to kill you, man. I don't want to do this no more. He's not aggressive. What the heck? Yo, he's usually hella aggressive. Bro. Bro, why? This is so funny. He's there. There you go. Back up. These animations are just so amazing. So amazing. Green grass. Ooh, two fire bumps in a row. So now we have to get colorless souls. Fuckity fuck. Why do we have to go through that, guys? Man, that's annoying. Alright, so since we're doing this video, uh, to use this weapon and make it stronger, we're going to have to level it up. But before then, we're going to quickly do World 4-2. World 4-2 hasn't been done yet, and since you guys are just here, we're about to do World 4-2. Live, baby. I'll show you guys how I will do World War Two. We're gonna quickly run through this. We're just gonna go right to the old monk's face and be like, "What's up, son? What's up, son?" So from here, the big guy, the witch. You can actually ignore the witch by landing here and just. Like, literally just strolling on out of there. And over here, we're going to take out the shield and put in the healing, John. Blessed mace. It says, like, yo, you can't use the weapon. Like, dirt, we don't want to use the weapon. So, here, this effort's going to come attack. We're just going to spam it, spam. He's dead. He just... Okay. Okay. Jesus Christ, you emo skeleton. I am using, literally, the first weapon I picked up 15 minutes into the game. Bait out their attack. Just skip through that. Just go into the fog. You gotta be confident, guys. And I'm a lot more confident than I was... Uh, the last time we played, because, oh my god. See this attack? We're probably going to get hurt a lot. We're just going to skip through him. We're not worried. We're going to heal here. And the second guy, he's going to do his attack. We're just going to skip through him and go right to their bitch boy. Bitch boy boss. Who falls down if you attack it once, usually, or twice. And that witch, she falls to her death, and all the other fuckers will disappear. This, you gotta get and jump out of there, because there's actually an invisible enemy there that will wreck your shit. We have no time for this nonsense, so we're just going to skippity-skip. These items there, they're traps. They're just green grasses. You can grab them if you want, if it bothers you. This is not our first playthrough. We don't need no time for that nonsense. We're just going skippity skip, skip the hop, hoppity poop, poopity scoop, de doop, de doop. And then there's these invisible enemies. You can, you can't really skip them. Like, see how like you can't skip it, unless like there's a certain animation that they do where they give you space to go through here. But we could just spam attacks. This guy's... Oh! I just went through him right there. Okay. So here... This guy right there does the attack. We skip this. 
we then have to we then have to look at her if you don't look at her and you run like you run this way right off the bat she will do her magic attack and wreck your shit so i am using a freaking sword to guard guys this sword isn't the weapon you want to use to guard not uh no siree but this is just to show you guys right veteran shit we played that was not veteran shit okay i'm talking a lot but watch me like die against this uh boss right here the old monk there is a really great katana called the hitless if you guys want to grab it it what i was literally in canada that explosion was all the way in freaking zimbabwe what the hell was that about uh right you can't see my point literally straight forward over there is a katana called hitless very great katana but we're not worried about that if you guys are gonna do a dex build before we start the boss i'm gonna show you one more time well look at my purple eyes bro sick 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 we are using the crescent fashion plus four literally we leveled it up three times by using the very materials from this world i didn't even get this far remember we're on four two we didn't get this far and we are just gonna go in and fight this boss the biggest thing we have in our side demon souls ai that was preserved do we want to watch this cutscene? just a little bit just a tad bit the vibration in the controller it like literally makes you feel this cutscene the rubble's falling him landing and the rocks they fall after he lands you feel that it's it's quite fantastic a blind boss so he can't see us but he big man so he does two attacks we can just literally walk through him what we want to do is wait till he attacks and then spam and what what that does is it gives us time to attack him like one extra time just one extra and now we literally are gonna bait his attacks you can literally just bait his attacks and go underneath him if you need to. See, we just underneath him until he does the this attack right here. This is the attack right there. You want to go a little far. Besides that attack, spamity, spamity, spam. You can't be afraid of this boss. He does the back attack. We go up. Oh. You just chill out. You see how he hit me? I was being cocky. I thought I was in the perfect distance. Just like there, I knew I was in the perfect distance for that attack. Dodge that, attack three times, four times, he goes, he's mad. Okay, this time we're gonna go a little further. I really thought I was in the perfect zone for that first time. This, this time I honestly was, like, asking for it. And that's the thing about streaming. Okay. That was... I honestly didn't expect that. We have enough healing items, so we're not really worried. Okay, see so guys, what I'm doing now is that stream mentality. I'm not focused. Let me focus. Penis attack, penis attack, penis attack.
He only has a little bit of health left, so I don't want to risk it. I'm just gonna stay focused. You see that? If I if I underestimated him right there, I would have died. That would have been it. That would have been it. I would have just died right there. That would have been tragic. That would have been so tragic. These attacks don't really bother me much because we know that we can heal. Jumping attack? No? Nope. Okay. See, now he's getting aggressive. But we're going to heal. And that would have been the end of us. That would have been the end of us. So th again, guys, this is not what we're trying to do here. We're, we're underestimating him only because I'm trying to show off for Shri. But normally when you play this, you're going to focus. Uh, what else would I, I would utilize is locking on and off, which I really didn't do. I just was, you know, running around him. I didn't lock on at all. So this gives you about 33k souls, which is going to still uh, go on to leveling up our characters to meet that perfect requirement. The perfect requirement to get our PvP build ready. We're going to use the Archstone to go back. So we got the spell that we came for. We got the spell. The second chance spell is, I'm pretty sure it's the old monk. I could be wrong. It could be the penetrator one. No, that's cursed weapon. So you come to our Kirk, Kirk Cobain. Is that you again? Yes, it's me again. Yes, I do. Oh, St. Urbane. I don't know why. It's second chance. Yes. A tune, second chance. So now, anytime we go and we fight enemies, uh, and literally anything we want to do now, we can have the second chance spell to use it. Wait, I could use it? No, I can't. See, I was tripping. So again, to use it, I need uh, 15 intelligence, which we're going to put our souls. Legendary Warrior Soul. Yes. You save your souls until you come to the Nexus where you can level up. Baby Boo, where are ya? There you are. She's the she's the she's my favorite waifu. Hi there. Hi there, cutie. Touch the demon inside me. Each flame? I like your candle. They smell like lavender and I love them. So 15. 15 gives us 100 MP. That's what we're looking for. So we're going to do that. And you see we're level 50 and normally I love staying in level 50 but for this build we're going to go to 55 maybe even 60. So, uh, the next part would be to fully level up this sterile sword. Hmm, to do that, we might have to get all the colorless freaking uh, souls. What else can we do? We finished five. We, we, are, we, we can finish three. Three is just beautiful. I'm so sad because I guess we got the road to getting the weapon has been completed so then the next video will be the pvp highlights after i grind and level it up this video was obviously a lot better than the first one because man i don't know what happened on the first one i was straight trash we're gonna buy three of these and suicide we can do a quick run of the world 2 2 go right to the boss just to show you guys like what i would be doing in my other bills i just use this weapon right here the crescent falchion is the best noob weapon to use to get to your build you do not want a pvp with the Crescent Falchion. 
if you are seen PvPing, you invade someone with this weapon, and you will lose respect right off. You will lose all the respect right off the bat. I see you with the Felshin, a Crescent Felshin, invading me. I'm thinking, wow, this boy does not know. When you invade others and they're using it, that makes complete sense. It's the number one weapon in Demon Souls remake, in my opinion, in PVE. There is a lot. There are way too many strong weapons in Demon Souls Remake, but the reason this is number one is because you can get this within the first 10 minutes of the game, and it can last you as far as you want. You can beat every single boss. You can even beat Soul Level 1. You can stay Soul Level 1. Soul Level 1. Power this up to the max and kill every boss. That's why this is the number one weapon, because it's so easy to get, so easy to level up, it's just too good. You beat enough bosses, and this guy goes crazy. I'm sorry, now he'll say, tell him to leave him alone. Who are you? I don't remember anything. Who are you? I don't remember anything. Who are you? The next time we come here, anything. he literally uh, becomes a soul. So, we're just gonna fight him. What are you doing? Let's go. Let's go. Come on, fight me. This is this is our first ever NPC fight. Okay, he does a lot of guarding. 108 damage while he's guarding. That's actually very good. Wow. Whoa, he's strong. Wait, 108 while he was blocking? What the hell? I'm so lost there. He was like, blo non blocking, it was also 108. Interesting. What a story he had. What a story that warrior had. Anyway, we're gonna do the next part with this weapon. Let's go. We're gonna kill the Flame Lurker Demon. Let's do it. We probably will lose. Who knows? But my first ever usage of the Sterile? The Strela? Stra Guys, I'm still struggling with how to pronounce this. I-S-T-A-R-E-L-L-E -L -L -E. is Taro. It's Tarrell. It's Tyrell. It's Tyrell. It's Tyrell. It's Tyrell. I honestly, like, it's bugging the f, f out of me on how to pronounce this weapon. Like, it's, it's Tyrell. It's Tyrell. So, 20 physical attack. That's so weak. That's why it's so much fucking weaker. Oh, God. That's so freaking sad bro why are you only uh okay so to get a colorless soul you could oh freak dude i kind of forgot like you gotta kill the big blobbity creatures on black tendency besides that the talesman of the god there's one other item that you can trade the golden mask the golden mask that you get from world two three two gang signs three two demon souls three two is the golden mask so golden mask and talisman god gives you two for trading with the crow besides that you have to kill the black world tendency creatures all right fuck it let's do this 28 damage 42 damage, 29 damage, just some random numbers. It's a strong weapon nonetheless, I mean... Could be stronger just because we have almost 30 faith.
I guess one of the other uh, big big advantage with spears is the reach. The reach and speed, maybe? Like, I can't tell. I've never used the spear before. Oh! Oh my lord! I didn't... I never saw the back... We never did the backstab yet. Let's do one-handed. Oh, oh, oh! We're gonna, we're gonna die. Just disappear. Just disappear. Okay. Let's see if we can just get the backstab on this guy. One stab. Kick. Oh! Okay, okay. So you backstab, kick the leg. I've never seen this animation. The black mace, baby. What you know about the black mace? Beat your bitch ass. Alright, let's let's do plan out attack, roll through, and get one more backstab. Kick the leg, stab Oh, that's really fantastic. Alright, Flame Liquor Demon, if you didn't know the shortcut. Alright, veteran move. You go down here. You roll in, roll in, fall here, roll out there, fall, roll. Fall one more time, roll there. If you have white roll tendency, you actually have to come here to talk to a character here where he wants to see the Dragon Bone Greatsword. And he gives you a pure Greystone, which is a crushing build. A crushing build is a pure strength build. One of the best weapons, in my opinion, is the crushing Claymore. Very fun to use. Use it too many times. Not as fun as using something new like the sterile spear. So you come here, you roll on out of there. You roll directly straight like that so you fall through all those cracks. From here you literally rolled in the corner and killed the Grey Worm. I think these guys, these guys are weak to magic. That's why they just disappear. Oh, I can attack upwards. Yo, hold on. I can I can attack upwards. Holy shit. So spears spears since it attacks forward, I'm learning so many fucking things with this weapon. I'm learning so many things. Since it attacks forward, we can kind of aim. Oh my god. I did not know this is a thing. I attack low, I aim low, I attack high, I aim high. Fantastic. By the way, this is the shortcut. The shortcut to the Flame Lurker boss. There's also these dudes here. That do fire attacks, that can actually kill you. Oh my god. We're gonna try to get this guy. Alright, this guy, aim, oh man, oh you a punk bro. Okay, you gotta be like that, oh okay, you're gonna be like that, you're gonna be like that, you're gonna be like that, bum ass, you know, they, were, they were doing what we usually do, where we spam the attacks, alright, this is my first ever First ever Flame Lurker fight with the Sterile Strayla. I don't like Sterile. Sterile sounds like the word where you're like, I don't know, is that the word where you're you're making your balls not work anymore? Hey Google, define a Sterile. Here's the definition of Sterile, not able to produce children or young. Yeah, literally, I that cannot be... We're going to call it Strayla. Strayla. From now on. We're not calling it no baby having spear. That's weird as hell. Hold on. First of all. Let's go on photo mode. Real quick. Let's do the pose. Not the sadness. The disbelief. Not the gratitude. The weight. No. The honor. Expression. Angry. 
I want you. Oh my god, girl. You good? Damn. She big man. Okay, we're on soul form. So we're going to have to do this again. On when we're in human form. Hopefully after we kill the flea market boss. Wow. So this weapon has wooden like carvings. What the heck? So it's actually wood and some type of metal. Probably like something really special. We're going to have to redo that. This is a really beautiful weapon. Oh my god. We're going to redo it when we're in human form. Alright, let's do this. I'm going to focus. Flame lurker. Let's fucking go. What the? F I can't see anything. Two attacks back to back, Lee Lurker. That's why I like Souls game, because you can only heal like three or four times. Maybe like nine times when it's fully leveled. So when you can heal forever, I have like 16 heals. That was weird. He, like, did damage, but not that much. That wouldn't have attacked. Come on. Come on. Behind you. Behind you. Alright, we're taking him for granted. We are taking him for granted. We are taking him for granted. Alright, we heal a total of like eight times. One more attack. One more one more attack. We're gonna do the R2. We're gonna do the R2. Dead. Bow. 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 Interesting. I'm quite confused. I'm thinking. I have an idea. I'm thinking that this weapon is doing more damage than the Crescent because we're two-handing it. But to... Look at this theory. We have to attack a creature one handed and then two handed. Obviously, two handing makes it every weapon do more damage. Every weapon does more damage by two handing it. What is making this purple glow? Wait, does this weapon make us glow purple? 
What the fuck? Kind of dope. We like we're glowing purple. We have this like this purple stink. This haze of love. Interesting. All right, we're gonna quickly. I got the perfect. I got the perfect enemy. By the way, we could we could have used second chance. Oh my god, why didn't we use second chance? We didn't need it, big boy. All right, one hand and two hand. We're gonna one hand and two hand. You're not, no, I'm not gonna do what you can think. I'm not fighting the boss. I'm gonna fight this. So, okay. 35. 42. Okay. 22. Okay, that was the last bit. I mean, you see that weapon, guys? You cannot grab that unless your roll tendency is pure white for this area. Which is easy to get. I think uh, we could probably... We can probably uh, get that tendency by killing the dragon god or before. Oh, wait, we already have that. So if you were to go back into that area, that dragon bone would be available. So we were going to go do that real quick. Why are we going to do that real quick? Because we can get a special item from, remember, the pure graystone. And then you get the boy... On black tendency and you get the pure you get a really awesome uh, weapon a weapon that can both use faith miracles and miracles and spells from just one item which makes things way easier this purple glow is so sick guys we need an area with good lighting Real quick, but before then, let's level up our faith one more time. Okay, we have to give this... We have to give this soul to our baby boy anyway in World 2-1, so let's go there. And that's where the lighting is. Fantastic. This is, this, this is going well, guys. We are learning a lot. And also, we're not looking like in an embarrassing fucking uh, piece of shit. Because, oh my god, I cannot believe how I died in the first playthrough of the road to the Strella. I like Strallo. That sounds really cool. I'm gonna actually Google how to say this name after this video. Alright, quickly. Is this a good area? Hell yeah. Picture mode. Pose. Honor. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Expression. Happy. Fantastic. <laughs> Alright, let's check this weapon out okay in-depth look at the shrala oh my god what what the fuck was that it just like hazed so did you guys see that it was like blurry for a second what the fuck was that that was weird as hell okay wooden uh tail little metal part more wood the carving is very simple wood like it's nothing nothing creative when it comes to materials but it's so artistic in the design of it it only has metal in specific areas this is probably like blessed metals from something and this carving is probably what gives us some freaking like um uh what's the word defense against plague and poison and that's probably why we're, we're freaking purple Alright, come on, get closer. So this side is the same as the other side. Yeah, the Valkyrie build is just a solid armor set build for like literally most most weapons and armors that look uh, sort of like royal, you know? This weapon looks like super royal. I love the glow on this side. Damn, I wonder what the carving say here. Like you get like some of the lore masters, some Bati Vidya in this bitch, and then look into 
the letters here. Wow, photo mode makes everything so cool. Like this is just me holding a weapon in Demon Souls remake in a sunny area where we're look at how massive. Holy fuck. This is an entire world. There look at what the heck's all the way over there. Is this an area that we can go to? Did we go is that an area that we visited? Like, we run around the entire thing and we got to that area? I don't think so. Okay, but it's the whole town over there. And I'm just this, like, little person in this big world. And we zoom in just to see the weapon and my amazing smile. Oh, wait, wait, wait. If you go far enough, you see the purple haze. You go close and the haze disappears. In photo mode, I guess the haze is something that comes off as like a, a particle that might interrupt photo mode or when you're in and the transparency becomes higher whatever what a beautiful weapon i am one i'm 100 percent sure 999 actually i'm 95 percent sure that you cannot level this weapon until you give my baby boy here uh the, the flame lurker soul upgrade weapon see the felshin just needs moon sheets to start shard and chunk uh, a bunch of these chunks and shards to get to level four and that's all you need you don't need to go to level five until you get the weapon you're doing the build for you see how this uh, our spear strala is not appearing so you talk to him a couple times you leave don't you dare turn your back on me well don't you dare make me have to talk to you four times to give you the damn soul you're looking for come on man you know you want it nice glow holy crap what do you bro what do you think i need you want me to come over here? You want me to lay on your bed? Don't go far with that pole arm. I don't even understand what that meant. Don't go pole arm. What does that? What does that mean? You take a pole arm to the bed? Oh, did someone fight him? No way! Someone got backstabbed or probably got killed by. Wait, where are you going? Did you just fall to your death? What the fuck just happened? I don't know. Let's try one more time. Come on, man. Dude, what do you think I need? Okay, you're bugging me out. Okay, now? Do you want me to stand in front of you? I am so confused. Searing demon soul. The soul of a flame lurker demon, a source of great power, gain a large amount of souls, blah 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 blah. What do you need? If it be a blacksmith, then show me your Are you bro, are you tripping? Why are you making this so complicated? I'm, I'm confused. What do you need? What do you need? What do you need? What do you need? It be a blacksmith. Do we have to kill the dragon guy? Be a blacksmith. What the fuck is going on? What do you need? Yo, bro, Ed, you're embarrassing me in front of my friends. I think we have hit some kind of glitch that I am not familiar with, fellas. I am uh, not sure what is a happening in this bitch. 
Okay, I upgraded something. I upgraded something. All done. Ed. Ed. Don't make me stab you with my spear, Ed. What is happening? What in the entire fuckity slut? What is happening? At uh, what is happening? Ed, what is going on with you? Be you don't need my business. Oh. I am so confused. I guess we gotta kill the dragon god, bro. Fuck. Yo, this purple glow is stripping me the fuck out. Alright, what else can we do before we go in our big ass grind to level up the Strada? That was interesting. I'm, I'm so confused. I am like so effing confused on what the F it's going on. Alright, anyway. We're gonna purchase the full moon grass, seven of them exactly. And we're gonna go. Change this to a black eye stone. To a blue eye stone. Let's do some jolly cooperation, okay? We do a lot of jolly invading, but let's do a jolly cooperation, fellas. So why don't we do that on World 1-3? Even though we didn't beat the Dragon God, because I finished five, the World 5, does that mean this goes away? Yeah. Bye. All right. While we put our summon signs. Oh my god! I forgot to kill myself. It's okay. We have gotten everything we need from the white roll tendency in this juncture. What's up, buddy? Nice try, buddy. Nice try, buddy. 148. Okay, hold on. You heal, 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 heal. 118 one-handed attack. The Crescent Falchion. Can you heal more? Can you heal more? That didn't, I can't measure this. Okay, hold on. I gotta measure somewhere else. Hundred and twelve. Hundred and twelve. Okay. So something is going on. I'm I'm not sure what's happening here. But the weapon says one ninety five. And Crescent Blade says two thirty Crescent Felshin. 238, but somehow I'm doing more damage. Make it make sense, guys. Okay, so this would be 158 no matter what, I think, right? This would be 158 no matter what weapon we use. We can use whatever weapon we want. And it would be... It would be one... 180. What? Or was that 180 before? Guys, I'm losing my fucking mind to test out this damn weapon! Alright, one of the things we definitely gotta do is put these to storage. Dagger storage. Mailbreaker storage. Blast Maze, not storage. Hand of God. Wing Spear, storage. Compound Short Bow. That we cannot use because we could, we cannot use because we don't have the strength. 
silver catalyst, spike shield, storage. All right, now we can easily move between uh, weapons. We're just gonna hold on to some of these uh, items, you know, especially, especially uh, our BDSM build. If we ever wanted to do the BDSM build, we could do that. All right, jolly cooperation time. But before that, we have to kill ourselves. And I killed the red dragon, so there's no red dragon to worry about. Every now and then you'll see me do that because I have once streamed, I will kid you not, for 24 fucking minutes. 24 fucking minutes until I realized my mic was off. Alright, we're gonna go past the dogs, let them attack us. We just want to, you know, quickly kill ourselves in human form, why not? Should we kill ourselves after we unlock the thing? Maybe we should. You see, they, they, they roll these uh, things, but if you stand right here, right here, you don't get attacked by the balls, because the ball, this one ball always makes a turn. Hey, look, there's a guy. We, how about we do some jolly cooperation? Wait, why can't I skip? What the fuck? They won't let me skip. Damn, that poor guy. Every time. How about we summon? And we use our spear. I can't even see the names, guys. It's so embarrassing. My, my face is literally blocking it. You fat bastard, we coming for ya! Wait, where, where did our baby boy go? What the... Did we just summon somebody? Oh, we're getting invaded! Hey, some jolly cooperation! Magic build! Interesting. Oh, he was just going to spam that main attack? Okay. Alright, alright. We're going to quickly heal! Hey, buddy. You're just going to do the magic attack on us this entire time, huh? You thought that's what you were going to do and we're going to get away with it, huh? This attack is getting so annoying. Okay, we need to die anyway. Thank you very much, Mr. Derby. Uh, honestly, we could have taken him in better circumstances. He kept doing the running attack, which is okay. I actually would love for him to invade me again for a fair fight. But we're going to do some jolly cooperation, guys. I don't like to invade or PvP without my weapon at the highest max. Like, if you're gonna PvP, you don't want to PvP with a plus one or plus two or no pluses. You can't do that. You should 100% always go for the highest of the weapon that you have specced out. All right, we gotta just, okay, hold on, hold on. We wanted some jolly cooperation in these dogs. The one thing I have to say is I'm really surprised that we survived that fire attack. Cause that was honestly like a one hit kill for most cases. I think he didn't expect us to have um, like a fully gold dull armor set that was pretty strong against that fire attack. Normally our damage wouldn't, our damage resistance wouldn't be that high. 
146. That attack, that little wind-up, that wind-up can get us in trouble. Twenty-seven, forty, thirty-three, thirty-five. So this, in fact, is stronger, but not by a lot. Interesting. Interesting. So the only way we can make it go higher damage is to level it up. Probably plus five. Because Crescent is plus four, so at least has to be plus four for us to compete. But the my my biggest gripe with this is I have twenty eight fucking faith versus only thirteen magic. That is like not normal. I'm really fucking confused, honestly. <laughs> The fact that this guy didn't get um, staggered from that attack was very annoying. Claw is a pretty cool weapon, and I usually like to run a poison claw just to do some troll builds. I'm I'm uh, learning so much. I think it's just like a short span of time right now that I'm having a hard time kind of understanding what we should do next. Hmm. I would like to just do one. Hey, there it is. We're going to finish uh, this summon wherever that leads us. If our main dude dies, we're going to do our best to protect him. And then... We're going to call it a night, and the next video, the, there will be no more road to Strala, because we already have the weapon, we'll have the build set up. Hey, what's going on, Relay? How are ya? Rely of the, Rely of the Dead. Rely the Dead. R-L-Y-E-H, Relay. Let's go on to greatness. Dog. Where's the dogs? You already killed the dogs. Okay. Did you just- you killed the dogs, you came back to summon me? What happened here? What's going on? Some jolly cooperation, guys. This is going to be a good time. Alright. Not the wall. Come on. Do the- do the finishing blow. Do the- do the finishing blow. There you go. Is that the blue blood sword? Whoa, she's using the blue blood sword? You cannot tell me she has a luck build. Dude, what are, are you tripping right now? You're using the blue blood sword? What? The blue blood sword? I'm... Tri I'm like... Really surprised. After you. Ooh. Ooh. Don't mind me looking up. Aha! 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 The fire's here. That means she has died here. She has to have died here. If the fireball's already here, she has to have died. You don't, don't go up yet. Let me go. Let me go. Wait, that's not the blue blood sword? That's just a straight sword. What is this weapon? Wait here. Just wait here. Riley. Riley. Wait here, Riley. Teamwork, Riley. You got this. Where's this other bitch boy? He's right here. Yeah. Alright. Doby. Is Doby the guy who fucking invaded me? Ooh, baby, baby. We should probably kill as many enemies as possible before Joby gets to us.
Remember, Doby will do the fire attack. And that fire attack will one hit us. Alright. Before. You know what? We can't risk it. We cannot risk it. We gotta kill the Red Knight. We gotta kill the Red Knight. Come on, do your attack. Do your attack. One, two, three. Okay, that fourth one, I was trying to measure. Woo! It was Doby! It was Doby! Doby just got wrecked! Doby, you bitch! How you feel? Yo, Riley with the truth! Riley is the truth! Somehow, the person we decided to get summoned by ended up being the one who helped us take revenge on Doby! Doby fucking... The only time I hear Doby, I, I, I want it to be a sound system, okay? Or is that Doby? Jolly cooperation. Hey, hey, I do this. I do the spear. I do the spear. And you, you bastards. You bastards. If Doby only knew. If Doby only knew. The horror we would lay upon him if he messed with our true PvP build with the Northern Regalia. We have the spear! Back up! Okay, this is a waste. There you go. Riley, this has been wonderful. Number four. You gotta do the four attacks. The last time we, we tried to get a little too happy and ended up attacking a little too early and we got freaking stabbed. Jolly cooperation! Disappear into nothingness. Disappear into nothingness. Stupid corpse. Alright, Riley. Let's go open the gate, Riley. Rile the dead. Rile the dead. Maybe it's not Riley's Rile the dead. I can't read anymore, guys. I need my glasses. Where's my glasses? attacking us and how are you so okay you need to back the fuck up from my baby boy Riley yo How do you pronounce that? R L Riley. Riley. That's not Riley's. Ryle. Relay. Really. This is confusing as. Yo, wait. Really? Where the fuck is so Strava? Did you not do the Strava? Bro, you did not do the. Oh my god. Did Riley not do. I'm just gonna call it Riley. The Strava. Uh, quest line tripping. Dab. Is that what? Is that the blue blood sword? I'm like really confused. I did not know you can buff the blue blood sword. That's like really tripping me out. Be careful, Riley. The three 
freaking red eye knights will get us. Jolly cooperation is fun. I literally have not done any blue phantom stuff. I only did black phantom stuff. Two people being two people here. Oh my god, I almost just died. Ooh. Oh no, Riley, I'm sorry! Riley, no, I'm sorry! Riley! I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm sorry, Riley! Forgive me! <laughs> Alright. I'm just- I lied, guys. We're doing an invasion before we go. Oh my god, that was so quick. We're not gonna be- we're not fully level, but let's invade someone to see. Uh, we're gonna lose, it's okay. But that's how we're gonna end this stream, okay? We're gonna do one PvP session. Doesn't matter how it goes. I will not be a sore loser, okay? But the fact that... What the fuck is going on? What the fuck is happening? What is happening? What is happening? What the F is going on, guys? What is happening? What just transpired here? What the F just transpired here? Dogs, I need your help, dogs. This They just gangbang me. I was not ready for it. I was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? He's just gonna keep summoning phantoms. Our first fight. And they're just out here summoning phantoms. Why? Why are you onion? Onion, why? Yo, we're, 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 oh shit, How's it, how do you like your own battle? How do you like it? How do you like... Your own medicine. Yes, true evil. Hey, Usiki, it has been an honor. And with that evil, evil footage of a gameplay, we're going to call it a night. In the next video, catch us with a specifically plus five strel build where we're gonna be glowing purple looking all types of sexy with their new weapon whooping ass god this game is beautiful Whew. have a wonderful night take care until next time